Hey, I'm Sven from the Music Project. Did you watch the first block of the programming LV2 plugins from scratch tutorial series? There I explained you the technical background of LV2 and sound processing. And we made our first own plugins. If you haven't done it yet, I recommend to watch these videos first. Our plugins still haven't got an own unique user interface. How they are displayed on screen depends on the host you use. This is often a bit minimalistic, so we will take hands on in this tutorial series. There are many ways to create fancy user interfaces. You can go the lazy way and use plugin frameworks like Juice and the Disco plugin framework to create a whole plugin including its UI. Or use a new UI editor like XUI editor, thanks Hermann, to add a new user interface to an existing plugin. What we want to do programming from scratch to understand the background of LV2 plugins with C and C++ and turtle language definitions. Taking a look into the LV2 specifications at lv2plug.in. There's a UI extension for user interfaces. For your information, LV2 doesn't come along with an own widget toolkit to create user interfaces, but it provides interfaces to the windowing systems for Mac, Windows and Linux. And there are also interfaces to the well-known and well-documented UI toolkits GTK and Qt. But how to do it? I will show you in the next video.